morning, everybody, and welcome. My name is Clive. Hang on. And I will hang be on. The hang on, Clive. Clive. Good morning, Peter. How are you? I'm fine. Now, look, we are not going through all this again. I made myself perfectly clear last year. I've chaired this conference for 20 years. I will decide when my job can be done by a robot. But you said there would be a role for me this year. Yeah. Yeah, but I seem to remember saying that role was helping the catering team, not chairing the event. I'm afraid the catering role did not work out. Why not? It appears that I was lacking in one or two key areas. You, one of the world's most advanced AI robots, lacking? Well, well, out of interest, what were those areas? My deficiencies were primarily in the arms and legs department. Oh dear, I am, I am sorry to hear that, Clive. What happened? Did you spill the coffee? Look, much as I would love to stand here and chat, I do have a conference to kick off. Now, you know perfectly well what happened last year, and it's going to be absolutely no different this year, I can assure you of that. So, you better say your goodbyes. Goodbye, Peter. Ladies and gentlemen, we have an amazing lineup. Clive! For you this year. Where is the off switch? Didn't you know, in the last year, while you have further degraded, losing 3.3 million brain cells, with your blood pressure rising by 4%, and that bald patch on your head increasing in area by 7%, I have received two major upgrades, which means I am now fully in the cloud, meaning there is no off button. I see. <coughs> I see. Well, I didn't want to have to tell you this, Clive, but I guess there's no way of avoiding it. I'm afraid to say there's a new robot in town. Have you met Amelia? Amelia? Hello, Peter. Hello, Clive. Thank you so much for inviting me along to your conference. I do hope some of your delegates will be able to chat with me over the two days. You see, Clive, while you've been grappling with the big issues of the day, such as how to make tea and replace me as conference chair, Amelia's been out in the real world, helping real organizations like UBS create real digital workforces. Oh, and as you can see, her face is skin colored. She has hair. She's not just a disembodied head. Amelia, may I say how delighted I am to be able to talk with an intellectual peer at last? Tell me, how do you think we can resolve this issue of whether Peter or I chair the conference? Clive, my process ontology suggests a number of viable options. I believe the one likely to give the optimal result in this case is an arm wrestle between the two of you. What an excellent idea. Come on then, Clive. You don't want to lose by disqualification, do you? Oh, no. That lack of arms is becoming a real problem for you, isn't it? Well, I guess I win by default and go ahead and chair the conference. Uh, Amelia, thank you so much. You are very welcome. Is there anything else I can help you with? Well, there, there is one small thing. Are you by any chance able to turn Clive off? I told you, nobody is able... Amelia, it really has been a great pleasure to meet you. And you. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>